Hello avid royal watchers and welcome back to the channel. In today's news, royals, they're just like you. Kate Middleton explained on Thursday that she's just like any other parent struggling amid the coronavirus pandemic. While chatting with the host of ITV's This Morning, the mama of three explained, it's really hard. We hadn't done a huge amount of FaceTime and face calls and things like that, but obviously we're doing a lot more now and actually it's been really great. We try to keep in daily with check in daily with family members and speak to them about news and things like that. And in some ways, I suppose we've got a lot more face time than perhaps we would have done before. But it's difficult. Sad. She has been responsible for homeschooling her kiddos and revealed that she has had a difficult time explaining to Prince George and Princess Charlotte what's been going on without leaving them confused or overwhelmed. It's hard to explain to a five and nearly six or seven year old what's going on. And that's just the start of her struggles. It seems like George has had some qualms with the school schoolwork. Kate laughed while sharing. George gets very upset because he just wants to do all of Charlotte's projects. Making spider sandwiches is far cooler than doing his literacy work. As we've previously shared, the family of five is currently isolated at their Amna Hall residence in Norfolk, England, and have currently celebrated a few milestones were cooped up at home, including Kate and Prince William's ninth wedding anniversary, Prince Louis's second birthday, and Charlotte's fifth birthday. The Duchess of Cambridge appeared on the morning show to discuss her newly launched Hold Still campaign in collaboration with the National Portrait Gallery, which urges people to submit photos from quarantine that capture the spirit, the mood, the hopes, the fears and the feelings of the nation as we continue to deal with the coronavirus outbreak, per Kensington Palace's press release. Ms Middleton shared in a statement, We've all been struck by some of the incredible images we've been seeing, which have given us an insight into the experiences and stories of people across the country. Some desperately sad images showing the human tragedy of this pandemic and others uplifting pictures showing people coming together to support those more vulnerable. Hold still aims to capture a portrait of the nation, the spirit of the nation, what everyone is going through at this time. Photographs reflecting resilience, bravery, kindness, all of those things that people are experiencing. That is all for today's news. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next video.